Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, blue shaded region inscribed uh, in these uh, three squares, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that the side length of this uh, large square is 21 units, whereas the side length of this uh, medium square is uh, 15, and the side length of this uh, small square is uh, nine units and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, blue shaded region please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe before we proceed any further let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100 percent true to the scale let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we can do we know that we are dealing with all these squares so if the side length of this uh, medium square is 15 then this side length is going to be 15 and this one 15 as well so let's focus on this uh, large square the side length is uh, 21 so therefore this side length is going to be 21 and this side length is going to be 21 as well and finally for this uh, small square the side length is 9 so therefore its other side lengths are going to be 9 units as well and once again we are dealing with this uh, tricky kind of problem so we are going to think uh, outside the box therefore to make our job easier let's focus uh, on uh, this uh, portion this uh, region therefore i have introduced this uh, rectangular temporary patch or sometimes we call it a dummy patch and here's the very first step we are going to do let's go ahead and focus on the whole area as you can see over here this uh, total area is going to be equal to the area of this uh, rectangle ac TP this uh, rectangle first and plus the area of this uh, square CDEF. So let's focus on this uh, rectangle ACTP. We know that its length this side is 15 plus 21, that is going to give us 36 units whereas this uh, height of uh, this rectangle is going to be 21 units and now let's recall the area of a rectangle formula area equals to length time width in our case our length is 36 and our width is 21 therefore the area of this rectangle ACTP is going to be simply 36 times 21 plus and now let's focus on the area of this uh, square c d e f now let's recall the area of a square formula area equal to s square where s represents the side length of a square in our case uh, our side length is uh, 9 units therefore the area of the square c d e f a is going to be simply 9 square and we know if we multiply these two numbers that is going to give us a 756 and 9 square is 81 so therefore if we simplify this one our total area turns out to be 837 square units so therefore our total area turns out to be 837 square units and here is our next step uh, let's uh, focus on this uh, blue area this is going to be equal to the total area that we already calculated in our previous step uh, minus the area of this uh, white uh, triangle ATP over here and minus uh, this area of this uh, white uh, triangle b d e over here now if i represent this area of this white triangle atp as a s of one this area is going to be a s of one for this whole triangle and for this area of this white triangle b d e let me go ahead and call a s of two that means 
this area is going to be a sub 2 then we can write this blue shaded area equals to total area minus a sub 1 minus a sub 2 and now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, white triangle uh, ATP now let's recall the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half time base times uh, height for this uh, triangle ATP this uh, base is going to be this is 15 units and this is 21 let's go ahead and add them up that is going to give us 36 units so the base is going to be 36 units and this uh, height is going to be 21 units so therefore the area of this triangle ATP is going to be I'm going to represent it by a sub 1 equal to a half time base is 36 and height is 21 so therefore our a sub 1 area turns out to be 378 and here's our next step let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, white triangle BDE and we are going to be using this uh, area of triangle formula once again and in our case for this uh, triangle BDE our base is going to be 21 plus 9 is going to give us uh, 30 units and the height is uh, 9 units so therefore the area of this uh, y triangle bde is going to be i'm going to represent it by a sub 2 equal to a half time base in our case is 30 and our height is 9 so therefore our area a sub 2 turns out to be 135 and here's our final step let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, blue shaded region and we are going to be using uh, this uh, equation and now let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, equation our total area is uh, over here our a sub 1 is right here and a sub 2 is over here so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks total area is 837 minus a sub 1 is 300 78 minus a sub 2 is 135 and if we simplify the right hand side our total blue shaded area turns out to be 324 square units and just keep in your mind that this uh, temporary patch that we added at the beginning we subtracted over here in case of uh, a sub 1 so thus the area of this blue shaded region turns out to be 324 square units. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.